Hello everyone, once again you are welcome. We are still updating you on what is going on in the country right now. Please, if this is your first time listening to us or you are just joining us for the first time, kindly support and encourage us by subscribing to this channel. Turn on your notification bell so you will be notified when we have a new video posted in this channel. Thank you. So as you can see in this video, Joe Ibokwe, who is a chieftain of the All Progressives Congress, APC, has accused activist Aisha Yusufu of exhibiting nonsensical behavior. Ibokwe said Yusufu was doing damage to herself and family by disrespecting the national anthem. As you can see in this video I'm sharing with you, Yusufu had, re had refused to sing the new national anthem, Nigeria We Held Thee, at an event. If you observe, she is the only person sitting down while others were actually standing. It's not like she was standing and not singing the anthem. She was sitting down and not even standing at all. So uh, Yusufu uh, was busy reading uh, uh, the program of that event. And this video was posted on X. So uh, Yusufu, who is who is the who is the convener of Bring Back Our Girls, and also uh, yeah, Bring Back Our Girls advocacy group, and also um, a diehard member of uh, Peter Obi, who is the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, could be seen using her phone while the new national anthem was being recited. So captioning the video, she wrote not my national anthem. That is, the anthem is not her own national anthem. So Ibokwe came up and accused her uh, of, you know, doing damage to herself and all of that. I said, let me quickly, quickly bring this to you so you can also see and hear what uh, Ibokwe, who is a chieftain of the People's Democratic Party, actually said concerning this action. I want to know what you think about uh, this action that... Um, uh, Aisha, Aisha Yusufu actually it, uh, it took during this event. Do you think uh, she's right by sitting down in an event like that and not reciting the anthem? And do you also think it's actually right for uh, Joe Ibokwe to come up to accuse her of damaging herself and her family? Kindly get to the comment section of this video and drop your comment. And please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you and have a nice time.